Hello, welcome to my channel. Today, I am going to calculate the number of microstates of a given system. This is a very common question given from statistical mechanics and can be seen in many question papers and also in competitive examinations. Hi, I am Siddharth and I found this topic very interesting. So, today we are going to talk about what you will learn from this video firstly a little about micro canonical system and microstates then distinguishable and indistinguishable particles and lastly calculation of microstates for both of them micro canonical ensemble talks about the possible mechanical systems it is a NVE system where each of these remains fixed. N is the total number of particles, V is the volume of that system, and E is the total energy of the system. When you have many particles, they prefer to stay in the system in a particular arrangement. This arrangement described by microscopic detail is known as the microstates of the system. Distinguishable and indistinguishable particles. Here, as the name suggests, indistinguishable particles are those particles that have similar mass, spin, charge, etc. physical properties. Differences cannot be made on the basis of their physical properties. Differences can be made in between distinguishable particles. Now, let us come to the calculation part. Consider a microcanonical system or NVE system with total constant energy equals to 4 epsilon with three particles inside it. Let them be indistinguishable in nature. The individual allowed energies then will be 0, epsilon, 2 epsilon, 3 epsilon and 4 epsilon. Now we have to arrange these particles in the four levels such that when summed up the total energy never exceeds 4e. Now, the first microstate arrangement, the second arrangement, the third arrangement, and lastly, the fourth arrangement. Now, when these three particles are distinguishable, that is, Let's term them as A, B, and C. We have the following arrangement as shown. Here, one has to notice that all possible combinations of these three particles, A, B, and C, are being considered. You can pause the video here and understand how these combinations are being done. Now let's try with five particles, five distinguishable particles and the same system with the same constant energy for epsilon. We can understand that as the number of particles n increases, the total combination also increase and hence writing down all of them is a very tedious job. Therefore, we first draw all the possible combinations with the five indistinguishable particles and then by using combination trick find out all the possible arrangements of them like first we choose one out of five as we have one in the 4e level so we have 5c1 and the rest goes to the zero level 5c1 is gives us the possible combinations. Next, 
we choose 1 out of 5 and put it in the 3 epsilon level and from the remaining 4 put 1 in the epsilon level. That's why we have 5c1 multiplied with 4c1 giving us 20 microstates. Now we choose 1 from the 5 particles at the 2e level. Therefore, we have that combination as 5c1. That will be multiplied with 4c2 as we choose 2 particles from the remaining 4 and the rest of them goes to the 0th level. And the remaining calculations are also shown here. What do we observe here? We observe as n increases, the particles tend to be found in a particular arrangement. That is, one arrangement predominates over the other. We found out that how we can calculate the number of microstates for distinguishable and indistinguishable particles. And I hope you found this video very interesting. Thank you for watching. Kindly like or share or subscribe to my channel if you like this video.